We can call now our inductees, but before, uh, I would like to call first the uh, president of the Stevens chapter, uh, uh, Dr. Vicky Hazelwood. So it will be the first inductee, <laughs> and then she will take over to call the, uh, the names of the other uh, inventors. So our first inductee as a member is Vicki Hazelwood. Thank you. Um, what, what an inspiring, inspiring guy. I think I see some of my students in the audience here. There were more here, but I think they had to run out. And uh, I don't know, what, what about it, guys? I want to be just like him when I grow up. What about you? Yeah, isn't that great? So um, I want to thank all of you for joining us tonight. And uh, I'm not going to try to top any of these fantastic speeches, but I want to take a moment to congratulate my colleagues here, you, uh, whose, whose unique work has um, earned a U.S. patent. I think that's a lot to be proud of. Well, congratulate all of you. And we, we heard the provost and the associate provost and Dr. Sandberg here explain um, the value and the need for this uh, effort. And I think your work exemplifies this institute's mission to uh, promote innovation and entrepreneurship within the university culture. And I know your, your innovative spirit has provided valuable and fun learning experiences to our students. You've already expanded the landscape for the faculty to develop ideas and collaborations and funding. And you have certainly enriched the Stevens community with a new dimension of enthusiasm and excitement. So, you know, whether you're at the moment, a role model for students and future innovators in your lab, or you uh, very soon will have developed the next game-changing or life-saving breakthrough, uh, you certainly will have a long-lasting positive impact on society, and that's what we're about. So I think today it's important, and I'm very pleased to assist in recognizing your creativity and your hard work as an inventor, and would like to induct you as an inaugural member of this newly founded Stevens chapter of the National Academy of Inventors. So with that, I'd like to start calling some names. Sesha Aluri, would you please come on up? Oh, I'd like you to note Paul is handing out pins. These pins represent the National Academy of Inventors logo. And uh, of course, we would like you to wear them on campus and help stimulate the excitement on campus. You can only wear one of these if you're a member and you have, of course, the U.S. patent. So um, I think students, wouldn't you like to earn one of these one day? Yeah? Okay. All right. Okay. Atula Adigail. Michael Bruno. Barry Bunin. I'm going to just say Mooley. Christos. Dmitry Donskoy. <laughs> Birik Gibra, is that how we say it?
Thomas Harrington. I think I saw Peter Cohen. There he is. George Kofiatis. You saw that, but Dr. Sandberg just gave Dr. Corfiatis his own pin. Sufan. Sufan. Ni Laval. Matthew Libera. <laughs> Svetlana Manolovska. Rainer Martini. Xiao wow. Guang Meng. Be sure. Young Shi. Tony Ovadovit. <laughs> Chi Hung Wang. Last but not least, Edward Whitaker. <laughs> 